Okay, and good morning, <clears throat> users and uh, YouTube viewers. This was sent to me very kindly by a company um, free of charge, so I've got uh, not affiliated with them or anything like that. And it, oh, let's go with it. And it's a charge control unit for your solar panel and your batteries. <clears throat> right. So in the box, you'll get your instruction leaflets, which are pretty straightforward, actually. Quick guide, solar panel, blah, blah, and all that. Charging uh, start conditions. Uh, it'll do lead-added batteries. It'll do, actually, it does tell you what it does do. It tells you it does, even on it. Hold on one second. I did read that somewhere. I think it's on the box. So, on the back of the box, what have we got here? Let's make sure it's in focus. Okay. So, you've got 30 volt, whatever that means. Um... Working voltage and ampage, battery types, gel, AGM, Life Pro, which is like um, lead acid batteries, plug and play, high security, mini portable. It's also got temperature control. So in a hot climate, it'll shut down and protect your batteries. Um, all the links and everything will be in the description down below. Let's have a quick look in the packet. It's a beautiful little tiny bit of kit, all electronic. Not even got out of the bag yet. So, there we go. That's a cute little thing, isn't it? Now, today with me, I have... Um, so I get that close up. I've got my lights on. Let me turn it off a minute. Is that any better? There we go. I have a battery with me. Ta-da. I have a solar panel with me, which is here. There you go. And we're going to have a go at connecting it up completely. So, Chai tells you everything what it tells. So, we, the best thing is just get on with it. The, also, it comes with these two, the leads that come with it. So, you've got one going to your battery and one going to your solar panel. Now, they come with spare connectors, which we've got two here. Okay. So, You'll see that they connect together and then the other ends are blank ready for use for whatever you want to use it to. So I'm going to use, I'm going to connect one end using um, these connectors. Focus. Okay. And the other end is going to a the solar panel itself using these connectors. And I've got a spare pair of these connectors. Now, just out of cure, just out of sheer luck, this is going on my boat. That's the idea. I've got the solar panel. I didn't actually buy it purposely for that. So <clears throat> I'll start connecting it up and start going with it. And then is there a cover on that? Is it? Oh, oh look at that. I love peeling this off. There we go. And so we're going to connect up the solar panel and the battery. But what we'll do before, we'll connect the battery up first before we connect the solar panel to it. That's supposed to be the correct way of doing it. Okay, let me just start doing these connectors and I'll come back to you in a sec. Okay, so I've just trimmed the wires, pushed the connector on the end. Now I've got a special tool. I mean, you can use a pair of pliers, whatever you want to use. I got it in focus. And then I've got these special crimpers, crimpers. And that. that this is going to the battery this one is going to the battery okay that's it simple done so when connecting them i've got my battery I've got special terminals on my battery i'll put a link to them down below as well and you've got negative and you've got positive uh, positive red negative black now i've had some stick over this and i don't care what people say there's young people out there who've not done this before haven't got a clue which is absolutely fine. That's the idea of YouTube, okay? That's what we're here for, to show you properly how to do it. So that's to the battery. Okay, so the battery terminal is ready to go. Let me just show you that, sorry. There we go. And put this back down. And then you've got to look at your little control panel here, because at one side, you can see that, battery, and the other side, solar. Okay, so we want to connect this to the battery side, all right? So here we go, and here we go, so give it a second, right, okay, so this is telling me it's got 12.2 volts in it, 
and we've got 75% battery. That's pretty good because I've been using this to run a diesel heater and it's telling me that it's a gel battery as well. Okay, so yeah, that's, well, I don't know what that does. Let's have a quick look. Oh, right, so it's 21 centigrade, 69 Fahrenheit. Uh, I don't know what that is at the moment. I'll have to have a look at it in the instruction book. I'm not even looked. I should look at the instruction book, shouldn't I, really? I just get excited. And back to 12 volts and naught amps again. Let me have a quick look in the instruction book. Okay, um, it just says error uh, on the mix. I haven't got the, I haven't got the solar panel connected. Um, <clears throat> but it's pretty, look at this, the instructions. It's pretty straightforward. It also tells you, uh, first connect the battery then the PV panel, okay, the solar panel. Uh, it tells you everything what to do. This is so straightforward, very, very clear English as well. Um, <clears throat> tells you all this. Let's, well, I tell you what, let's get the solar panel charged up. But you won't have a problem with this. Also, I've read somewhere and I'm looking for it. Oh, E00, no error. Okay, whatever that means, no error. Cord, and there's the codes there, no error. <clears throat> So I recommended for none. Do, do not. Do, 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 do. I'm looking. I did say. It did say somewhere that it's actually waterproof. Let me have a look. Okay. So I've got the solar panel in the window. I've crimped my solar panels with these connectors I have. These. I mean, I don't know if everybody's got these. You can use standard screw connectors. You can use. You can solder them. You can do whatever you want. So these two wires are coming from my solar panel. Okay. You can't go wrong. They're all labelled positive and negative. Okay. So we've got positive. And then negative red positive black negative and now what we're going to do which we uh, are going to test now to see if we get the charge from i'm just trying to get you view with this hold on right turn the camera see if we're going to get a charge so same again push him in wait a second Give it a sec. And there we go. We're now getting a charge from the solar panel. Works beautifully. So it's pretty straightforward, actually. It's just like, you know, what we got here now? 12.3 volts, so it's gone up. 0.4 amps, so that's working. 23 centigrade, 73. That's, I suppose I think that's, in, that's internal. And that's fine. That's what it's supposed to say. There's no errors. That's impressive little bit of kit. So this is going on my boat. <clears throat> so um, just to clarify, to make sure your, your terminals are around the right way. All the links for this device and everything will be in the description down below. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm not affiliated. I'm not really bothered about that. I just like, I like playing. Uh, the connectors, you can't go wrong really. I mean, it's, it's up to you how you connect it. This is the way I did it, but there is other ways you can do it. You can use block connectors. You can solder them, you can do whatever you wish. All right, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and a like, that would be great. And uh, we will definitely, definitely catch you in the next one. Uh, I'm impressed with this. It's all automatic, you can't go wrong. Take care, see you next one, all the best, bye. Oh, sorry, just to clarify, you do get a spare uh, clamp with it, uh, or extension, I presume this is an extension. Uh, but you can get these they're in uk you can get them anywhere it's a standard fitting um okay yeah so they're actually just called sae cable connectors they're available anywhere i've just looked now radio amazon ebay you can get them anywhere you want all right just so i clarify that still charging chuffed to pieces see if we've got any more voltage in the battery ah yeah 12.4 loving this and five amps take care catch you in the next one all the best bye